Masak apa? Mi goreng. Okey wat. Trying to root some garlic and lemongrass. And now for some fun. Finally, we have a cooler day, cloudy, and some rain. And last week, we got a moringa plant. And I'll put over here uh, what are some of the benefits. And our dragon fruit um, plant is blooming again for the third time. We haven't got any fruits. So I don't know what. <laughs> and I haven't cleaned up my thing yet. <laughs> Procrastinating. We got a new coop last week also and we got this one for free from Facebook marketplace so this will be our rooster rooster pen we need to soundproof it this is spooky she's our oldest hen And I was going to show you how close the motel is. So that's the motel. Right there. <laughs> Here is what I'll be doing today. I won't finish it today, but yeah, I had a good start. I'm digging up um, all the weeds and fluffing up the soil. 
and then we're gonna put uh, some fresh um, soil on top and make a raised bed Chuk 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 Stop destroying my beds Here's a look at the uh, grass and the weeds and the soil and the soil is very puggy uh, clay like as you can see it's like a plaster scene it's heavy heavy soil but it's good soil uh. it's a uh, volcanic volcanic soil around this area because of mount warning plaster scene you just need to work it a little bit to reap the benefits of this soil also i guess it doesn't help that um cows have been like walking on top of this soil for years so it's all compacted and stuff but it's a rich 
rich soil as you can see from the the color i guess chilies the dry chilies which i made into a powder or chili flake i think so from the two uh trays from the other day i got one of that and two of these not too bad and this is uh, pickle okra so I can um, store it in the cupboard rather than put it in the fridge and take up fridge space pickle chilies green chilies so how you do it is uh, you make the pickle liquid first with vinegar and water salt sugar and whatever you want to put in you boil that and then you put the chilies in for like 30 seconds and then you want to have your jar ready sterilized uh, and put it in as hot as you can like um, heat wise so uh, after you put it in you turn it around like that and it will seal itself see the top here it's sealed so if it's not sealed there will be a bump so that's not sealed and you have to put it in the fridge huh oh huh very good okay bye